Look at this. Y'all know where I am. Carlos, the school teacher. <laughs> oh my goodness. And look who's here. <laughs> Paul, fruitful trees. Hey, who's that? Good morning. <laughs> it's fruitful trees. <laughs> Orlando Garden, everybody. Yeah. How's there, everybody? That shirt, Kev. Thank you very oh, much. Getting a tour, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going to be amazing, ain't it? A couple yeah, of years. Yeah, yeah. In a couple of years, you see a big difference in this place. Yeah. Wow. Nice. Yeah. Amazing. This had two mangoes. I took them off already. Wow, y'all. Old classic. This is the Excalibur. Ooh. She has Excalibur. Oh my goodness, imagine if I had this property. Ooh, something's ready. Wow. He has fruit on his trees this year, y'all. This is ready. Wait a minute, don't talk about Super Alfonso. <laughs> Listen, man, Paul just sent me one. Um, <laughs> look, I just called Montero Gardens. I just called him today. Paul has been telling me for the last couple of years, Super you got to get it. Man, I had one when it first came out, and it was like, man, blah. Really? Yeah, and Paul Even has been saying. was amazing. Yeah, yeah, the one he sent me the other day. Um, and I did, and I did. I, let, I took one that was uh, just a couple right. of days, <laughs> and I let one go. Yeah. The one that I let go, man. It, yeah, man. yeah, it blew me away. It was good. Yeah. Don't, don't ever, everybody, don't base your taste on one or two tastings. You got to taste something several times before you determine if it's good or not. Yeah. So I've tasted stuff that was terrible and turned out to be great. And yeah. Vice versa. Right? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This Super Alfonso was amazing. Oh my goodness! <laughs> yes, I love this. See, the other times that I've been out here, nothing was on the trees. But this time, I'm trying to go to trees that got fruit on it. Which one? Oh, get away. No, Duncan, Duncan. <laughs> uh, this looks like a little gym. This looks like little gym. All right, Carlos, don't don't prune these no more. Let me see. Little gym. Yeah. Little gym. Yep. Yeah, that's real gym. Ooh, something over there has a... Wow. Ooh, this is maturing. Whatever it is, it's maturing well. It looks like Kathy K3. That's what it looks like. It looks like mine, at least. Oh, there's a tag right here. Yep, Kathy. <laughs> but you get around these fruit trees for a while and um you start to start to get to know the way they look. Oh my goodness, man. Listen. Growing with mangoes, y'all it's gonna be something fabulous here. In the near future here. This is gonna be one of the premier places to come and get fruit.
taste fruit. I don't know what this is here. Oh, wow, look at that one. Mmm. Might be Venus. There might be Venus there. This is pretty. Ooh. Carlos, the school teacher. That looks like Angie. Look at that unique shape. And that little pip. Look at the water. Give me something to drink. I'm thirsty this morning. It's Angie. Yep, Angie. Look at that. Okay. That is a beautiful mango tree. That is a beautiful... Okay. If you're saying it's so beautiful, Kevin, why are you running away from it? Show the people. Look at it. Reminds me of Carrie. Ooh, look at that. That's beautiful. Ooh, that's beautiful. Look at that. Super Alfonso, I just ordered this tree. That that's that fruit is delicious. Maha Chinook. Maha Chinook. Yes, sir. Yes. Look at this leaf. Hey, don't say anything. What do you think that is? Orlando Garden is going to give us his opinion. Uh, Just from right here, it looks like Maha Chinook. Thank you, brother. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That, yeah. Maha Chinook. Right. Now, this one was labeled yeah. lemon meringue. Oh, no. Yep. Now, no. this one's labeled Maha Chinook, and the leaves are very different. So, could it be... That that one was the lemon meringue. Tags and this got one was switched. the Maha Chinook. It, it, it can could happen. be vice versa. Could be anything. We'll it find happens. out. It could be anything. We'll find out yeah. when this one produces it. Paul has a mystery tree down south. Yeah. No, yeah. I can know what it is now. You do? Sugarloaf. Oh. It's a sugarloaf. I wonder wow, who told you. I wonder who kept telling you that's that. That's not a bad <laughs> that's not a bad mystery tree. You turned out to be a sugarloaf. You're right. You're right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I know I, I've had them get that little point to yeah. them. The little, the and that threw that that's the first time Alex saw it, he was like, no, I'm sure it's not. And then he looked at it, he goes, I don't even need to see it, it is. Yeah. I have a, a mango over there that was mislabeled as a Valkyrie. Maybe uh -huh. you can take a look at it, because I can't find it nowhere. Well, I've looked I, at all the pictures, I've looked at it, I can't find it. Let's keep moving. Yeah, they, 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 <laughs> will, they will actually, mangoes will change form yeah. at times. Not yeah. all the time, but every now and again, they will. This is a cac. Ooh. Right there, you have a Mauritius and a Sweet Harlichi. This is what we call Guido Avocado, which is the long one, like the Russell type. Mm. This is the red variety. Uh, right here is just avocados. So I have different types of avocados. Mm. I have Catalina, I have Oro Negro, I have uh, Simmons, I have... Uh, and Yo, this, this is hard for over here, so I got to cover that up. How you doing, up. son? I'm doing good. Good to Check see you, man. Out. All right. The cameraman today. Yeah, I am. Oh, wow. Look at flowers. Ah. At this time. Oh, my goodness. It happens sometimes. This is a piña colada. Piña colada. I don't have any on my trees. Piña colada. That one yeah. over there is the ice cream. How pretty mm -hmm. little ice cream is. Yeah. This is, I call this fan sapadilla. It could be it, it, most likely the mollusks. Look at Paul's shirt, y'all. I love that. <laughs> Look All at that. Yeah, yeah, I love it. I love it, though. Yeah. So and I, I got me one. I have the Ross Sapote and I have the green Sapote here. So I have these here. I have some gandules. These are Dominican gandules. They grow eight and nine beans per yeah. pod. Wow. Yeah, so it's it's pretty, pretty nice. That's right good here, food.
in a decade. Right here I have some fruit. Oh, these are all seedlings. New varieties of uh, jackfruit seedlings that are coming out. So this is jackfruit, crunchy dwarf. I have bubblegum jackfruit and I have another variety over there. And new varieties starting to come out. So even if the cold hits and it dies back, since I know they're seedlings, I know what variety they are. So. What are these? The longings. Yeah, these are longings. And what tree is that? That's another longing tree. Now, you know these are close together. They are close. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm packing them up. All right. Packing them up. Um, so over there and over here, I have Sugarloaf Sister. What is this, Kevin? Karen Michelle. Karen Michelle. Mm. <laughs> That's one of your favorite, right? Yeah, well, look, one of the, the best I've had yeah. this year. So I have two Karen Michelle trees in the ground. I don't blame you. I have <laughs> the two jackfruit trees, so the, the black gold and the gold nugget. Mm. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Right there, I got the buttercream. Mm. Buttercream is there. I have Simmons avocados here, and I have two guanavana trees that actually came from Africa. Wow. They call it yellow guanavana. So they come out and they grow and they turn completely yellow. When you cut it open, it's Kevin white Michelle. on the inside, and on the outer layer has a little bit of strawberry taste, like a berry tree taste. It's guanavana and berry. It was kind of cool. Very nice, man. Thank you. I am yeah. so happy. Thanks for showing us around. Yeah, cool. I'm a New Yorker. I'm from Florida. I'm planting some trees. Yeah, man. Um, you just punch in living with mangoes, and you could go right there and you see all the videos. Pretty much what I've done so far is I'm, I'm a newbie at this, so I've just done recorded some videos doing taste tests, give some information. It's more educational than anything else. So it's a little different from just regular taste tests. I give a little information on the actual mango, and then I have different people. Some are newbies, some are not so newbies, and we taste them, and we, you know talk about what we taste and what we like and, and that's hopefully what we're gonna do before you leave today we're gonna have three mangoes we're gonna do a sneaky taste test and you guys are not gonna know what they are and you tell me which is the best all right thank you and could I get in my yeah camera? Juan Carlos the school teacher this is my son Francisco Francisco you're the one that's gonna be doing all the work here one day <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna take over when I'm when I'm when I'm mango? when I'm crawling huh how do you feel about mango oh I love them what's your uh, favorite mango Valkyrie what's your favorite fruit my favorite fruit is mango. Okay. <laughs> How about you? What's your favorite mango? My favorite mango right now as it stands, I like my orange sherbet, um, P22, and Super Alfonso. Those are the top ones right now for me. Mm. And what's your favorite fruit? Mango, of course. And I like guanabana also. I what's your fruit. favorite mango? Oh, man, Paul. Uh, you shouldn't have gave me that uh, <laughs> Super Alfonso. But still at the top, it's like uh, I watched your film the other day and how the you kept asking the people and for until Dot came along, everybody kept saying sugar loaf. Yeah. It's hard to be the good sugar loaf, man. Yeah. But lemon zest, man, look, look, it's 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 <laughs> wrestling between lemon zest and sugar loaf. What's your favorite fruit? Uh, mango, okay. mango, and then watermelon. Just for everyone, notice here. My favorite fruit is not mango. My it's favorite my fruit main, is right? durian. Durian. And I'll put three or four other fruits before I even get to mango. Wow. Now, when you talk about That's growing amazing. fruit, and mm. mango's the easiest to grow, but I'll take a white sapote, I'll white take sapote a durian, awesome. I'll take a mame. Good friends of mine. I'll take a, by far, I'll take a, a custard apple. Before mm. I take mango as my favorite fruit. Mm. And when it comes to mango, I mean, the top ones that are up there, it's hard to pick one, but. Yeah. It's, I mean, lemon zest is yeah. great. Yeah. Wiperee <laughs> is awesome. It's out of this world. <laughs> Ice cream, Bombay. Yeah, even the Bombay. Uh, Bombay is very Look good. Look at this property, y'all. Right. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, like, we can't grow durian. Have you ever had durian? No, I've never subscribe. had durian. Yeah. And I know it's very difficult one. to grow there anyway. So yeah. I don't think I'm going to attempt it. Got a taste to do. Yeah. All right, we're gonna look around a little bit more here. 